Hello, it's Mark T Dog. I'm going to show you how to properly update your Flight One board. So I plugged in this Revolt uh, or Millivolt OSD up here. It tells you the version of the configurator on top, 1.2.62, and then the version of the flight controller down here. This is the on 49, 1249. So I want to update this to the most recent one. So I'm going to click Update Firmware. Then you've got a couple options. This one doesn't do anything. This one up just copies over the new firmware. And it's not really recommended to use this one. This is what is recommended, especially when you're upgrading to a new newer firmware or any of the betas. You should always use the DFU mode. And what that does is what it says here. allows the bootloader and firmware to be updated, updated not just the firmware. So you, you hit this button, reboot FC into DFU mode. So what that does is it reboots it into DFU mode. And this is where you want to update the firmware from. So welcome to DFU mode, DFU mode, update firmware. Sometimes you'll have the option to select it from right there. But I'll just use this for now. I'll hit confirm. It's going to erase the chip. And this takes, obviously, away any of your settings. So this we'll just write in the data here. All right, it's almost done here. And then it's going to reboot it. Boom. All right. And now we're loading. All right, so it comes to this. We found previous settings. Now, it is not recommended to import these, especially if you're updating from betas, because it might uh, write over a variable that's been changed or something that's different. So I hit cancel here. And then you start, then you just run through your wizards and set up your board. Uh, I'll have some more videos coming up for Flight 1. This is just a quick, easy one. Thank you.